Okay, one of the major concerns that patients have when they start fertility therapy is the risk of increasing the chance of ovarian cancer. It's a question that I get asked often and a full explanation puts most patients at ease. Ovarian cancer has been studied in the fertility literature since the early 90s. In the early 90s, there were a series of small publications that suggested an increase in the association of patients who take fertility drugs and ovarian cancers. Later studies found out that a lot of this risk was attributed to poor recall. It was an information pamphlet that was sent out, and patients tried to remember if they were taking a fertility drug or not. Oftentimes, what they thought were fertility medications were in fact the birth control pill or other preparations that had nothing to do with their fertility. When further studies were done looking at the association between true fertility medications and ovarian cancers, there was no increased risk. Even more reassuring, recently, in 2012, a large study by the Mayo Clinic, patients who were undergoing IVF and using fertility medications had no increased risk in ovarian cancers in a large study published by the Mayo Clinic. There was also another large study published by the National Institutes of Health and leading cancer centers throughout the nation looking at over 54,000 women, and there was no increase in breast, colon, or ovarian cancers which makes me much more comfortable in utilizing these medications to help women start their families. Fertility medications have also been found to be safe in women who have used these treatments in 12 to 14 separate attempts. In fact, a large study out of England showed women who used these medications up to 20 consecutive times had no increase in ovarian cancer. All of the data seems to show that fertility medications are safe and they're effective and that allows us to help take care of many couples safely and with confidence.